We're next. Oh yes, back to New Serena. much about bartending though. <laughs> no problem there's nobody in here right now anyway and with a big guy like you behind the counter i don't have to worry about security got it have all the free whiskey that i like i particularly want that 17 year old yamazaki what wait what um, <clears throat> anyway touch my whiskey and i'll kill you i'll be back soon See, I think I'll start with that, and then I'll have that. Oh, and that looks quite nice. Yes, I think I will have all of that whiskey. Maybe a couple of bottles of this. Hmm? Oh, I thought I heard a ghost. No, just no customers still. Wait, somebody's coming. I especially know this because I'm staring directly at the door. Hello? You the owner here? Yeah. We're from Ashimoto Renovations. We're based in the city, but we mainly renovate old buildings all over Kemarocho. Ashimoto Re Renovations? Where have I heard of that name before? This building's pretty darn old. I bet it was built before the earthquake-proof construction was implemented. What I'm really worried about is the termites, because those little buggers will lead away at the foundation. Yes, termites. World famous and renowned. For eating concrete. Then if we look, it won't take us too long. Termites? I'm pretty sure this building's made of concrete. I'm half. I'm te very tempted to let them in inspect for termites. Um. Refuse politely. No, this place is made of concrete. Not exactly a delicacy for termites. Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah. Uh, sorry about that, buddy. I guess we got our buildings mixed up. But what about your plumbing? You got any leaks? Spare pipes? We think we better check on the plumbing and just be on the safe side. No, I think the plumbing was just fixed. Refuse. <laughs> No thanks. We just had the plumbing fixed, so I'm sure it's fine. Oh, yeah, really? Well, if you say so. But before we go, what's your smoke alarm situation? They're required by law now, you know. They're just talking about it on TV. Yeah, you gotta pay a hefty fine if you don't got no smoke alarms, then a lot of people have paid dearly when fires break out with what warning. Smoke alarms? I'm pretty sure this place had them put in a long time ago. Back when Rainer was running it. No need. I'm pretty sure this place had smoke alarms put in a while back. 
I was there. Raina had me up a step ladder for a very long time. We won't mention the rest. Well, now I'm curious. I mean, oh, well, uh, I hope you're right. That's enough. This place is fine, so get out. What the hell is your problem? We're nice enough to come down and try to help, and now you try to chase us out? Maybe we ought to teach you some manners, perhaps. I'm dying to learn some. Let's take it outside. Or regret there's more ways than one pair. Oh no! Con artist construction firm. Is this the same construction firm from the last game? Oh yeah, you did it that time. Not dead, by the way. <laughs> My collarbone! Stop cheating people out of their money. Okay, time to find my next customer. Oh, wait, she's already here. I'm back. Did you get any customers? Uh, no, none, no, no customers. Couple of con artists, but no customers. You know, I was just talking to the restaurant owner nearby. He was telling me there are a lot of renovation scams going on around here lately. People asking about termites, smoke alarms and such. Oh? <laughs> Those men on their way out had coveralls on, so I thought they might have been a couple of phony re uh, renovators. Did something happen while I was gone? Oh, nothing important. Nothing important at all. Uh, ignore the missing bottles of scotch, by the way. I, I don't know what could have possibly happened to them. That's fine. I'll add it to your tab. Anyway, here's something for your trouble. A big favor after all. Huh? I couldn't make you watch this place for free. But I'm pretty sure that I. Well, I mean, I'll take that. I mean, um, whiskey? What whiskey? I, I, I just stood around here the whole time. And I can take them. I can't take money from you when you've. After all you've done for me. I'm a proud Camarocho woman. I refuse to make you work without paying. Just take it and make me happy. I'll, I'll gladly do that. <laughs> All right, if you insist. Five fifty thousand yen, nice. I might ask you to help out again sometime. Now that I know I can count on you. Yeah, I'll take it. Awesome. <sighs> so those renovators were a couple of scam artists, were they? <laughs> Oh, hey there. You will find that construction company you were looking for. Sure did. In fact, they swindled me out of my money with some phony renovations. But I heard that president was just arrested by the police. Arrested? Apparently, some of the workers went into the hospital with some injuries. And they were identified by law enforcement the... I see. Will you be getting your money back then? <laughs> well, the police said they'll get me my money back, but... Well, so I can rest well in my old age. But I'd sure like to shake the person's hand who smashed up those blasted renovation workers and send them to the hospital. <laughs> You're welcome. All in a day's work for Kiryu the Mighty. Um, well, we've got a new sub-story unlocked. We've got a new sub-story unlocked. Right, let's quickly nip back to Serena and save the game. Oh, Date suddenly appeared. Everyone suddenly reappeared. Okay, that's fine.
some pretty chill music. Maybe I should see where it is and try and use that. Actually, it comes to think that I do need to cut to get a new closing melody, considering I'm pretty sure Disney or Square Enix are going to pull me at some point for using Daily Beloved from Birth by Sleep. So, hmm, don't know. I shall have to think about it. Uh, see if I can find any... Well, Sega are usually pretty good with the soundtracks. Uh, there's a sub-story around here. Is it inside the sushi restaurant? That is not the sushi restaurant. Is it inside? That's not the sushi restaurant. I can't talk to that dude. Um, this is the sushi restaurant. Is it in here? Yes, I miss it. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Coming in. What can I get you for today? We have some beautiful tuna, red uh, tuna, red meat, fatty belly, seared cheek. You name it. How about it? Care to try our tuna today? Yes. Also, hail Dark McCloudy. Yes. You got it. One tuna medley coming right up. I want a tuna medley. Hello, the samurai. Hail. Oh. The tuna they got here today is so good. Of course, they get their stock from me, but even so. Oh, sorry to butt in like that. The name's Sawada. I guess you could call me a tuna professional. I run a fishery, you know. When I see someone who loves good tuna, well, I just have to speak up. I hope I'm not bothering you. No, not at all. <laughs> but you, you're a big tuna fan, am I right? Hack, I can tell just by looking at you. The real tuna connoisseurs are the ones who always go after the nicely marbled meat. They always look to... Interesting take. But you know, you'd better get your tuna eating in be now before it's too late. What do you mean? They're disappearing from our oceans. I heard this big shot scholar guy say that if we keep fishing tuna like we have been, they'll be extinct in the near future. Now that you mention it, I think I remember hearing something like that in the news. So now we've got no problem where we want to enjoy the tuna, but you can't. In good conscience, at least. <sighs> Real killer dilemma, right? It's a tough situation. But all hope is not lost. That's where tuna farming comes in. Never heard of that. Maybe in the news or something. Farm? A tuna, you say? Good Lord Great Scott! Uh, no, that's a new one. Come on, you got to pay attention to the news. Why, tuna is a jewel of the sea, isn't that right, chef? If a sushi chef runs out of tuna, he may as well close up shop for the day. Tuna's a jewel, all right, the backbone of our sushi economy. See, that's exactly what I mean. The tuna farming is the only solution. It is the way of the future farms. Tuna will save Japan. And I'm thinking of using my fishery to face the challenge of tuna farming head on. We have this special food for tuna too. It's guaranteed to fatten them up bigger than you could ever you would ever see in half a year. It is called beer. I'm looking for investors of ten thousand yet a pop for what I will call the tuna fund. Catchy name, don't you think? With enough investors, I can expand the tuna farm. Once we start bringing in the big money, we'll all take a share. So, want to invest in the tuna fund? Get your wallet fatter than that than one of my fish. You'll never find a juicier opportunity, I can tell you that much. Sounds sketchy, but all right. I suppose it won't hurt to invest a little. <laughs> uh, come on, don't be shy. A real man should dive in at first. They're even starting to eat sashimi in China. Didn't you know? Tuna sales are going through the roof. Tuna halls are shrinking, but more and more people are eating it. The price is going to soar any day now. That's where my company's famed tuna comes in. If we raise them up nice and big and sell them off, we'll be rich in no time. 
I mean, technically, I, the way I can see it going is most people will want the fresh tuna from the ocean, and the farm tuna will probably just go to supermarkets or something, but yeah, okay. Also, tuna are really big fish, so I'm quite curious to see how they're going to farm them. But, eh, whatever. Selling it at 10,000 yen a piece. How many shirts would you like? I'll go for a hundred shirts. Um, let's go for a hundred shirts. My goodness, a hundred shirts! Thank you very much indeed. Now, if you'll just fill out this application here. Perfect! Now, that's settled. I just need your payment. There goes a million. Um, <laughs> Send out the status update on my tuna farm via email. There'll be something to look forward to. <laughs> I'm off to find some more investors. Thank you again, and I'll see you around. Right, either I've just been conned, or I didn't even get my tuna. That's slightly a jip. Am I about to suddenly find out that I've been? I've just got another tick mark on this bloody list. Oh no, tuna fund. Investor tuna fund recommended the sushi bar. It seems to be tied with Okinawa somehow. Nice. Well, we can catch tuna in Okinawa, as we have learned. Right, let's go and do the other question mark at the top of the map. Oh yeah, I also was going to change the settings back on the encoder because for some reason it's still doing a thing. Medium, low latency didn't work, high quality then. Apply. Profile, what if I change the profile to mid? Or to main, rather than high. Let's see what we get with that. Ooh. Ah. Oh no, an angry punk when she to fight me again. dead by the way possibly disabled but not dead <laughs> right what was that doing? oh right I was looking for this question mark there it is That's a big dude. Oh. Yeah, all I hear is salt, miso, soy sauce. Oh, I didn't join a sumo stable to learn how to make nabi. I joined so I could learn the art of sumo, dang it. So. What's the point of making some BS stew when I could be wrestling my ass off instead? You're out of your mind, Ikamura. There's no way you're ready for the ring. You need more practice, more discipline, and at least ten times more navy. That's how you get strong. Ah, ah, but I got enough already. Besides, I don't need any more practice. Just get me another ring and I'll show you. So this is Ikamura. He seems to have quite a temper. Oh, wait for him to calm down. <laughs> no way I'll... Oh, there's no way he'll talk to me in the middle of a tantrum. Waiting for him to calm down would be the better option. Ooh. Never mind. Hey. Are you Iwakuma? Uh, Iwakuma? Ooh. 
what you want about it. Well, I was hoping we could talk. I'm Kiri. I was I'm working for the casino. I'm current I currently have I'll try that. I'm Kiri. Now I'm working for a casino. We're current we currently have openings for bouncers, so I thought I'd recruit you. There's a bouncer! What kind of crud is that? I'm gonna be the next Yokozona man! Without proper training, you'll be lucky if you let the <laughs> if they let you sweep the stable. Tiger's train! The boss train! I'm so strong I could take on the world champion with one arm tied by my back. I mean, look at this massive body! And you! You'll say you're good enough to be Japan's top sumo wrestler! Tell me why I should listen to some guy who's probably weak as crap! You want me to be a bouncer, then you're gonna have to defeat me! That'll be whatever the hell you want! The watches are squeezed the life out of ya! Now, technically, I'd be too busy having the life squeezed out of me, but okay, sure. Doing so well as well. There we go, from self. Do you think he'll listen to me now? Tigers need to train. No, but they can be dropped fairly easily. <laughs> How could this possibly be? I thought I was destined to be the king of the ring! No, won't be the king of anything without getting enough practice in. I'll just become a bouncer. Well, I'll be able to fight more opponents like you. Can't say for sure, but there's always the possibility. All right, then. I'll do it. Nothing like a real fight to test a man's mettle. Are you sure about this, Hikawara? Sorry, boss, but I need to do more than just stir veggies in a pot and call it a day. I need to get strong enough to shake up the entire sumo world. In fact, I'm bringing the title of Yokozuma straight back to Japan. Yeah, you heard me. I'm gonna be the champ. Good. Then let me set you up with this place. It's in a building on Park Boulevard. You can go there whenever you're ready. Okay, got it. This sounds just like the kind of training I need. Cool. 80 sub-stories complete, blimey. Right, um... I do believe that is also the last of the sub-stories for the moment. So, with that said, let's just go and save. Apparently we can save inside the park, so we'll do that. I think. First we'll go to this restaurant, conveniently on this corner, and heal <laughs> before we go and do the next... To, to actually do some of the story. Dun, dun, Hmm. Rami? Yeah. I also use the throat looking just to that voice. <laughs> oh yeah, we also need to do the hostess, don't we? Sacrilege! I know well oh uh, Um where did that vocal zone go? <laughs> Give me a minute. Ow. There we go. I'd like to check, please. Of course. Please pay the register. Just also I realized I need to go and talk to more hostesses, but I'm going to give my voice a rest, and instead we're going to do the story. Also, it unlocks the casino, so we can do some more of the gambling. Rest in peace, pool bar. But thank goodness I don't have to play that stupid mini game in Camarocho as well. Right. What? What? 
Oh, right. <laughs> yeah, they're okay, that's just going for smoke. Hey, you look familiar. Hmm. Just a minute, son. You're not heading to West Park, are you? Why for the moment? Dice Waifu, Yakuza Free right, Remastered. And I only say that because I don't know her actual name, but she is the woman who runs the Chihan, uh, the Chohan in the gambling hall. That is the Waifu of the moment because, yeah, she's pretty. It was a hard toss up between her and Waifu Chan, which is the barmaid from the, the, the owner of New Serena because she is also very pretty. Though I was planning to, is there something wrong? Yeah. Uh, I wouldn't say that, but hardly anyone ever goes in there since the Mushroom family swooped in. I see. No, I thought all the homeless people who lived here were kicked out. What are you doing here? I guess I could, couldn't just say goodbye. Been here too long. Even the homeless can get attached to the surroundings, you know? Actually, I've just also realized it's been a long time since I've seen Wife at the moment. <laughs> Most people have forgotten about it. So, cool. Or maybe they just got fed up with me not being able to think of an answer right off the, off the top of my head. Um, actually, oh wait. Actually, I know just about everything there is to know about this park. Go ahead, ask me a question. Try and stump me. Hmm. Well, I don't really have any questions. Huh? Oh, I find that hard to believe. Come on, I'll bet you've got loads of them. I do. If you don't ask me now, you'll regret it. We'll start simple. Take this place's name, for example. I bet you don't know it's called West Park, even though it's on the northeast side of Camarocha. The origin of the park's name? Actually, why do they call it West Park? <clears throat> oh, why do you think? Because a man named West built it. <laughs> That's a good one, but nope. Actually, it turns out it was a mistake by the city hall. What? Apparently, the head of the town planning at city hall was kind of sloppy and messed up the name on the map. The park was open almost four years before anyone noticed. Now I guess people figure there must have been a good reason for the name, the name park like that. So they never questioned it. I can see how that would happen. It wasn't until they received an inquiry from someone who visited the park that the mistake was brought to light. I suppose they could have changed the name to East Park, but it's not like it had another West Park to compete with, so they just decided to leave it as is. That's quite a story. Most of us just call this place Purgatory now, so I guess it doesn't really matter. No, I guess not. By the way, I believe the man who built this park was named Hiriyama-san. Now then, do you know why the people call this place Purgatory? By all means, tell me. Traditionally speaking, Purgatory is a place between this world and the next where the dead are purified before they're sent off to heaven. In other words, people thought there was another world beyond this one. Hmm? So... This side of the door is the land of the living, and the other side is the land of the dead. In a way, you see, compared to the outside world, this park was just a little bit closer to heaven. At least, that's how it was for us homeless people. We didn't have to worry about the cops harassing us, or some punk kids trying to beat us up. Except the homeless hunters who went on a rampage through the park in the 1980s before they were mysteriously beaten up by a man in a white suit. The streets of Camarocha were like hell compared to Purgatory. That explains a lot. I guess one man's hell is another man's heaven. There used to be a secret network of rooms beneath Purgatory, where the wealthy could drink and gamble all they wanted. <sighs> but now it's all deserted. The place is a lot more in common with hell than it does heaven. No! No, have all the waifus gone? Don't tell me that! It was only two years ago, man! What's it like now? That's one question I can't answer. If you're looking to find out, you'll have to go inside and see for yourself. You'll want to be real careful, though. All right. 
By the way, have you ever heard of a man they call the Florist of Sai? Yeah, no, I know him pretty well. This legendary informant who ran his way, what? <laughs> I mean, <clears throat> he's a legendary informant who ran his whole operation out of purgatory. I guess his name, got his name, because he delivered in info to his clients in bouquets of flowers. Now, wonder what he's up to now. Florist moved his base of operations to the Millennium Tower during the incident with the Jin One Mafia, then went back to purgatory. Sort of sat there doing nothing until Majima managed to open his open the secret vault by smashing his head into a marble desk. Come to think of it, that was a really weird and really weird occasion. But eh, I'll go with it. Majima in it. Not sure where he is now though. Guess I should have asked Date San about it. That's all I have to say, sir. Above you, son. No, that was really interesting. Though I really do wish he could have explained more. I can't say for sure Mashima's uh, is my friend or my foe. No, I need to be ready for anything before I head inside. I mean, yeah. What should I do? Continue. Oh, no, bugger. No, you are ready, Kiryu. Go in. Come inside. Fine. Right. Well, it still looks like Majima construction. Okay. Double oh seven for assistance, really? I do like a rotary telephone. That's some joker level nonsense right there. Hello. Oh, hello. How big's the Majima family gotten? Majima no Nisa. Suman no Kiruja. おどろかせてしもて。これは。ま、俺なりの防御策や。最近危のうて堂々と事務所構えることもできへんからな。ようこそ<笑> Majima cleans up really well. I'm digging the suit. Really am digging the suit. Oh, Akutezu. Got just the place in mind. Don't go falling behind, Kiryu Chin. Oh, look, the main character. Yes, stood there with Majima. Couldn't resist. Oh, Majima, what did you do to the waifus? Gordon Bennett, man. I haven't been doing anything wrong. Most depressing part of the. Oh, Gordon Bennett, of course we're going to the blasted Coliseum. Majima, get a Majima, yes. Let's stop, Kiryu-chan. The Colosseum? Oh, 
only things fighting in there now are the dust bunnies. It's nice and quiet. You've got my word, shall we? Maybe waifu break time. Maybe waifu break time. Yeah. him as the MC. No, oh, he's the fan favorite. This has changed a lot in two years. I'd like to get back into practice with the Majima voice as well. Majima got rid of the women and replaced them with muscular men. I know. I mean, I can understand the logic of it, but still, you could have at least kept some of them. Oh well. Got fond memories trading blows here with you, Kiryu Chan. Too bad it's a ghost town now. The colour seems closed. Been so for about a year now. Something else came up, pulled my attention away. Right through the moment. Every woman in purgatory. Now, um. Majima. We'll go with, we'll go with Majima. Majima is wife of the moment. Why not? Something like the Okinawa Resort deal? <coughs> oh, sorry. Something like the Okinawa Resort deal. Oh, what the hell is that look? <laughs> oh, that made Majima look far creepier than it should have done. Uh, guess the vapor's out of the bag then, huh? Majima san, why did you do it? Why did you get involved? I was keeping an eye out for Daigo, just as we promised. What do you mean? I was just trying to make stuff easier for him. You know how intense all of the pol politics gets? Dago didn't want any part in the resort deal. That's why what's well, got him shot, right? Been wondering about that myself. Majima-san. Here you Chan. I don't think you could have come up with this whole resort scheme on your own. You have to be working with someone. The question is, who is it? Why aren't you saying anything? Majima son, tell me the truth. Now. Kiryu chan yo. Konna ore ni mo na, gokudou toshite na suji chu mo ga aru ya. Tato e ore ga soitsu ni hamerare ta toshite mo, tada de kuchi wari yo na kota deke hen. Oh, that was fast. Also, this music, man. Oh no! We have to find Majima! I'm so surprised! It's so out of character for him! Ladies and gentlemen! リングの上に戻ってきました。王子城の絶対王者王島の竜キリュウカズマ<笑> 
このやり方がお似合いやああそうだなさあ手加減はなしや思いっきり行くでケリアちゃんや今ゴングです That was an awesome cutscene. That was an awesome cutscene. Stop me, it usually stops me. Oh, break it style. Oh, yeah, there's the stopping. Oh, right on the jewels. Okay, Mashima's turned into Sonic, apparently. Block any of those. Ow. Ow. Ah, that's the wrong thing. Oh well, I was going to try and do the ultimate move on him, but I don't have enough time. I'll have to use one of my stronger healing items, I suppose. Mesmer is now an online battle, pretty much. <laughs> That hurt. 
Baku's a free. Dodgy's a free, more like. Yeah. Giving the crowd a show, aren't we? Ow. Is the one make, that makes me use my first stamina royale of the game. might be British. Awesome if he is. more fun than most of the fights. <laughs> Awesome. That was awesome. 